receive your complimentary cup. Now after the first cup, rock punches are $2 and fruit punches go for a dollar. So bear in mind guys, the more you drink, the more you see. So guys, the dock we just pulled away from is called the islands, renaming it Paradise Island. Now to the left of the vessel at the western end of Paradise Island, you may notice the Nassau Harbor. your left, the wooden structure sitting in the harbor. Now that home belongs to a famous Canadian writer by the name of Mr. Claps. It is said that during his divorce settlement, his wife got the larger mansion on the northern side of Paradise. That was the smallest as well as the oldest. The small strip of sandy white beach still to your left. Well, that was once a nude beach. First premier of the Bahamas, Sir Roland Simonet. It is said that he and Lady Simonette made most of their billions bootlegging alcohol, good old rum, Mr. Feelgood. Since his passing, that home those are the national fish of the Bahamas, and they are featured on our $100 note. Now the Bahamian dollar is on par with the U.S. The Bahamas is an archipelago of 700 islands, over 2,100 keys, 33 of which are inhabited. So if this is your first time down, over to your left on Paradise Island, all of the homes we're going to be passing. Those are all time-sharing apartments or condominiums. Now if you're looking to purchase a home down here, third home to your left, beige walls, white rooftop, blue and yellow awning. Now that home once belonged to the late queen of cosmetics, Mary Kay. It is said that when she lived there, the home was pink. The grass was pink. She drove around town in a pink Cadillac. She also had a little male poodle by the name of Pinky. To the president of the Sandals Resort, Mr. Gordon Butch George. smaller mansion amongst the coconut trees, white walls, white rooftop. Now that home belongs to George Myers. He is the vice president of Sandals as well as the owner of Myers Rum. <coughs> His neighbor to the back up the hill, white home, dark shingle rooftop. Now that home belongs to Sheik Haraji. Presley. The stone structure with the white picket fence. And that is the French Cloisters. It was given as a gift from France to commemorate the independence of the Bahamas, July 10, 1776. 